And at the best, I doubt, I honestly doubt, if Team Hell No will even make it to the Final Four without without turning on each other. I mean, they'll make it, but they'll, they'll turn on each other and someone will get eliminated. Daniel Bryan, though, this might be a ma good match for him. Kane, same thing. Honestly, I don't really care who wins. This will be interesting nonetheless. And a match out of, light, out of right field. Um, people have been calling this the shield versus the sword. The Avengers versus the shield. I call it filler. As we have Seamus, John Cena, and the man that wants to be fed more and more before he gets fed whores, Ryberg. Facing the Shield. Now, for those who don't know who the Shield are, let me indulge you for one moment. Seth Rollins, the former Tyler Black, former Ring of Honor World Heavyweight Champion, former NXT Champion, the first NXT Champion ever. Hell of an athlete, hell of a competitor. Kind of looks like Salt Snake in this fucking picture, but nonetheless. Uh, D. Ambrose, the former John Moxley. Feuding with Regal and FCW all the time, uh, and also up uh, with uh, Ambrose, for, for I forget, former FCW 15 champion, former FCW champion in his own right. Uh, but Ambrose, feuding with Regal, having the best match of his career possibly with Regal, and I'll know where he's in the shield. I love it. And finally, the former Lea Key, Roman Reigns. And I, I honestly forget who he's related to in the Samoan Heritage family tree of clusterfuck. I really do. But the guy is impressive. He may be green as goose shit, but he's impressive. With that being said, the Avengers will fall and the S.H.I.E.L.D. will survive. I don't know this is a, uh, if this is a Elimination Chamber tag match. I don't care. The, the S.H.I.E.L.D. will win. And finally, the match that everyone's been talking about, John Cena versus The Rock. I honestly think the title is wrong there. I think CM Punk currently has possession, and possession is uh, nine times a lot, therefore he is the WWE Champion in my mind. Even though The Rock did win cleanly, that was a markout moment for sure, the Royal Rumble. But... Here's the, here's the thing. Last time we did this, it was a standard one-on-one. -on -one. Now, with Vince McMahon in a hospital bed, deranged as all fuck, having a surgery on his hip due to a cause to uh, Brock Lesnar, actually wasn't caused by Brock Lesnar, he needed the surgery anyway, and at the time to write him off. But the fact he was on the phone with him was hilarious. Um, but here's the thing. If The Rock is counted out or disqualified... Then CM Punk retains his WWE Championship, not regains it. I do not count this reign as a Rock of the Championship reign. I like it, but I don't count it as the reign because of the bullshit with the Shield in that match of the Royal Rumble. Should have Rock won cleanly in the, in the second fall, but uh, as far as I'm concerned, I have lost count of how many days CM Punk has held the title. And it would be apropos if CM Punk were to win, were to win the title. Just let's just say he fucking wins the title, because at this point he's not a champion. He's not a champion at all. He says he is, but he's not. He has a title. I like CM Punk, but this is just weird, really weird, even for me. And honestly, The Rock might win this match anyway because the fact of a Cena. Rock 2 would be a must-buy. The so-called twice-in-a-lifetime would happen again. Speaking of that, seeing him seeing in the Royal Rumble, he will uh, face the WWE Champion, whoever he is. So it does not matter who CM Punk... Well, actually, it does matter who the champion is. But it doesn't matter if it's CM Punk or The Rock. Cena, unfortunately has this title shot, especially with the Kendra Lust situation. Oh my god. That is a... 
I'm not even going to talk about that. I'm going to say that for a later time. Because that in itself is newsworthy. Even if it's not true. Allegedly. But, Legend Chambers this Sunday. Actually, it's a few hours away. By the time you're watching this, it will probably be already there. Who will survive as the road to WrestleMania rolls on in the Super Bowl? Hopefully, the lights won't go out permanently.